You've been he's been talking between all the songs tonight, but I took the liberty of introducing him here, ladies and gentlemen, Jesse Daniel. He beat me to it. All right, everybody, how you doing? I want to go ahead and call Jody Lyford up here. Jody, where are you? Jody. Hey, there she is. Everybody, so good to be here. Do you enjoy all these songwriters? Everybody, give it up for them here. Never taller than you. Hey, this is... It's a treat. Everybody has their day, you know what they say. Hey, so I'm going to play uh, some new tunes. You guys, we got uh, a new album. Like I mentioned earlier, we're going to be going down to Texas and making this new record. And we've got the Kickstarter going right now. After this evening, we'll have nine days left to make our goal on there. And if you'd like to pre-order the record, you can do so at a very low cost. And it helps us tremendously. So please, if you enjoy these tunes, go ahead and do that. This one, this song right here, I'm going to play you. So Jody's dad, growing up, he used to have a saying, you know, if she started to swerve all over the road or anything, they are driving. If she'd deviate off the path, he'd say, hey, Never. keep it between the mayo and the mustard. You know what I'm talking about. So I always really liked that. And I thought it would make a great country song, so I went ahead and wrote one. It goes like this. It's called Mayo and the Mustard. There was a time in my younger life where I hustled every place I went. I drove the roads hauling heavy loads so I could feed my kids and pay my rent. At a rest stop diner, I met a wise old timer. He offered up some good advice I never would forget. This is what he told me, he said. Keep it between the mail and the mustard when you're driving up the road of life. If you start to swerve and then a curve, it ain't nothing gonna turn out right. Just take me time and watch your speed, cause it all goes by so fast. In this race, there's no first place, and you're lucky just to come in last. Mr. Paul Cronopolis, come on! Lucky 
I came home one day and I, I walked in the door and I remember Jody started talking to me. She said, hey, how's it going? I said, oh, hold on, I got this idea, mayo and the mustard. Hey, don't we have a birthday? I think we do have a birthday. Thank you for reminding me. That handsome gentleman right over there, Sage Wilkinson, that's my brother right over there. <laughs> birthday boy in the house. Very proud. A little bit about my brother. He's a firefighter. Putting his life on the line to keep us safe. He's up in San Francisco, but he was down here protecting us here in uh, Santa Cruz. So give it up for Sage. Love you, brother. Good to have you here. That being said, I'm going to play this one for you, Sage. This one's called Champion. Well, this song may not be about you, it, this one's for you. And I always like to say this too, is there anybody from the Central Valley here? Central Valley of California. There's always, no matter where you go, there's always one person. All right, this one's a song about a, a guy I used to know a long time ago from Modesto, California. He was a scary dude. Built just like a wall. He had circles under his eyes and he stood at six feet tall. He rode an old bicycle that he stole from off the rack. Kind of man when he takes your music, you don't have for it back. His hands were big as baseball gloves and his fists were solid rock. He was born out in Modesto from pure old Louis stock. Moved here with his mama, but she left him long ago. And he looks just like his daddy, who he never got to know. It's best to be here, cause he only had this name they called him Champion. Cause he never lost a game out in that old folk town. He's the toughest of them all. Never knew a man to challenge him that didn't take the ball. do something right now that we've never attempted live. It's called a mid-song capo key change. Tyler. 